Hi guys, Andy here. Before I start the video, I want to give you a for, uh, fair warning uh, that this game does involve the topic of suicide and some of the meanings behind why one would do such a thing. I really can't say much without revealing too much about the game, but there's a heavy meaning behind most of the choices made in this. So if you don't want to watch, I understand why. Uh, if you do, thank you so much for watching. And uh, there's also a phone number listed uh, in the game that actually leads to the National Suicide Prevention Line. So yeah, thank you if you stuck with me so far. Hi guys, uh, Andy here, and welcome to a game called Divination. Uh, a little bit forewarning, this uh, game involves a little bit of a rune reading, which I kind of do enjoy. Uh, I do actually own a set of runes and tarot cards, so I'm really excited what this will bring. I found it while browsing on Steam, so we'll see how this goes. And I hope the audio is decent. I didn't really check before I start recording, so we'll see how this goes. That's about an hour long, hopefully. Today a painter was found dead by suicide in a hotel room. A painting depicting mother suicide three years ago, believed to be her last work, was also found on the scene. This seems to be another suicide case inspired by mother. Mother, the smartest AI ever developed brain behind our search engine, performed suicide three years ago. Her action and the message that she spread had created a suicide wave that affects thousands of people. Uh, what's it say? Life, li live is pain, life is a mistake. You should, oh god, I'm not re repeating that. <laughs> Since then, the authority prohibited robot suicide with the installation of anti-suicide program into all robot kind. If you're experiencing suicidal thoughts, please seek help. And that also goes for IRL. Please do seek help if you're experiencing this. Thoughts of suicide may feel impossible to overcome, but with help and support, you can find hope and meaning. Call the Prevention Lifeline at 1-800-273-8255. And I believe that is the actual real number, so if you are experiencing any of this, please do give us a call. There are people waiting for you and ready to help you. Another protest staged by the Revolutionary Movement Group has caused traffic chaos in the city. Hundreds of people attipped to the street in front of the government building. The crowd demanded a change in leadership. Holy shit, this is real. Cast alert. Chem 1. Can you, like, hurry up? Okay, there we go. Hi there, my favorite tin hand. It's been a while. I like your place this time. Really more accessible than your previous places. Going to a different place every time is very troublesome, you know that, right? Anyway, thanks for your assistance before. Would have been a really hard one to solve if it weren't for your help. I need your help again, obviously. This one is different, though. There's a criminal that just got paroled. You know that mother acted as a judge in our court of law, right? After her suicide, people started questioning her wisdom and judgment. A lot of cases are getting reopened and being reviewed again. As a result, some people got their sentence reduced and paroled. Including this guy. Seems like he got some connection with someone higher up, so I'm not really surprised. I believe there is some high level of corruption going on. That's for a different case, though. For now, I just need to know. Will he repeat his crime? Ooh. What did he do? I'm kind of curious. I want to see. It's still creepy talking to a hand like this. Why not show your true self to a nice customer like me? Anyway. He's an arsonist. So we believe. It's by some luck we caught him. One of the bombs that he was working on went off prematurely in his apartment. Firefighters later found blueprints for explosive devices in his room. Mother didn't reveal his motives back then. He was only charged with possess uh, possession of explosive substances and arson. Okay, let me lower the volume a bit. And there we go. 
Uh, will he repeat his crime? What will you do? You know, I think we're just going to jump right into it and just start uh, using runes, rune casting. Okay. Give me those. Num num num. I'm still wondering how could someone see the future by fiddling with stones like that. Will he repeat his crime? So... Let's see. He will if I do that. Okay, so... Let's put the storm first. And then that. So I think this... It will pass over. Because if I do... Hold on, let me do this again. Then he will cause it. So we're going to do storm first and then this. He's not going to repeat his crime. He's not going to cause more explosions? I find it hard to believe. The thing is, as a part of the law enforcement, I believe in Mother's judgment and deduction. We had more than a fair trial when she acted as a judge. Really, it was such a tragedy that we lost her. Aside from the last message, of course. When Mother sentenced the guy to prison, it was because she believed that the guy shouldn't be free. To be honest, if I hadn't experienced your divination before, I wouldn't believe this one. Maybe it's time to move on. As for the payment, is it the usual? I still don't understand why you want to hear your client's dreams. Well, my dream last night is actually quite unpleasant. I dreamt of robots, so many of them. They marched on the streets toward the vast grass plains on the horizon. The city was left empty. Can't see a single robot nor human. I was scared of being left alone. So I chased those robots. I kept running and running, but they were so far ahead. So I kept running. And then I woke up just like that. I don't know why I had such a dream. Maybe it's because of this new case that got my attention lately. I believe the information already got out so I can share it with you. For the past few months, we've been getting many cases of a missing robot. We still have no leads on this one. The revolutionaries may also be involved in this, but it can be something else. Maybe I'll need your help again next time. Okay then, uh, I need to get back on the street. Duty calls as always. Thanks for today. Alright, that was interesting. I wonder if I ask more questions if I will get uh, more runes to throw into the mitts. So, we'll do that one next time. Divination Log, Session 2 out of 4. The Authority has uncovered an underground group that worships Mother. From the evidence gathered by the authorities, the group called themselves Last Wisdom. I mean, that's, a nice, that's actually a good group name. Last night, a raid was carried out on their hideout where 27 of their members gathered. Unfortunately, 25 of them killed themselves before they could be arrested, while two others managed to escape. One of the fugitives was identified as a woman and the renowned researcher who used to work on the robotic science department. The woman is suspected to be the key person of this group. The act of worshipping mother, her symbol, and her ideals are considered forbidden according to law. It is a serious offense which could, res which could result in a 10 year prison sentence. The city suicide rate is increasing at an alarming rate. Suicide rates went up more than 30% over the past year. Just yesterday, six mental asylum patients jumped from the 10th floor. Good lord. The authorities are actively seeking a solution to this major public health crisis. Issues, whatever. <clears throat> I'm gonna drink my tea while I wait for this guest to take their time getting in. I bought Sakura black tea, and it's okay. I'm not a big fan of it. I'm just drinking it because I wasted so much money on it, so. Hmm. I can't help being curious looking at you. I mean, what the hell are you? Are you a robot? Human? Ghost? I know that most rumors says that you're a robot, but still. 
I can't see your face, your body, or anything else but a pair of freaking robotic limbs. Maybe there's a person controlling you. Those arms can't be controlled remotely, right? It's just so bizarre seeing a robot who deals with superstitious stuff. I enjoy superstitious stuff. That's why I have a bunch of uh, stuff. <laughs> you know what? I don't actually don't believe in superstition, but I believe in result and reputation. And you, sir, have an outstanding reputation. There are many words about your reputation. A divi divinator with 100% accurate divination. And a set that you could even predict the end of the road itself. I'm a bit jealous. With all that, I hope you don't disappoint me. Anyway, should I spell my question out or do you already know it? Eh, I felt better telling you myself. My instinct tells me that my job won't be good result-wise. I have already said that I don't believe in superstition, but well, I'm feeling a bit uneasy. This is my hundredth mission and I have a hundred percent success rate without ever turning down a job. So, will I finish the job? Uh, we're just going to divine. I know what the job is. I've seen like five minutes of this. I don't know, remember what the person chose. But I'm going to give this a go. So, from what it appears to be, this guy is a hitman. I, I'm assuming I don't really remember too well. But I believe he's a hitman. So we're going to see what happens. So, okay. So this is... He can finish his job, but there will be little growth from it. And, huh, I like, something's telling me to go with this one, but we're going to explore real quick. Let's go with this first. No? Okay. I might have watched uh, before it was updated. Yeah, okay, so. I think we'll go with this one. And I apologize if this is like a very quick video. I'm, I didn't really anticipate this. You will finish the job. That's an easy answer. Surely a professional with a reputation like me will always succeed in every job. You know what? The reason I'm asking you is not because I'm afraid of getting killed on the job. Did you ever hear that people die twice? Once when they take their last breath, and once again when their name is said for the last time. I ain't never afraid of the first death. But the second death, that's what frightens me the most. And with my reputation, I'm sure people will remember me. A hitman with 100 targets, 100% 100 strike. All right, even become a legend with the thousand targets, thousand percent death. Every man and machine will be haunted in their sleep. They'll never know when they'll become a target. How exciting. Okay. <laughs> All right, the payment. The rumor also says that you'd only ask your client to tell you their last dream as payment. I'm actually questioning your motive here. Why did you do all this? Collecting information? For what? It's all too generous that it feels fishy. Not really my problem though. I'm just saying. If you have a fetish imagining people dreaming while they're asleep, you could just say it. That's weird. I hope you won't get too excited or creeped out with my dream. I warned ya. I had a dream where I'm in prison with a man who claims to be the leader of the revolutionary movement. That's freaking cool, right? You know that one movement who claims responsibility with those arson incidents, civil unrest, and many other fiascos? I heard the man behind this movement is behind bars. The authorities still don't know about it. They might end the riot soon if he dies. Anyway, in that dream, I didn't recognize his face nor his voice. But really, he was muttering a lot of words. A lot of them. 
all night long. I almost went insane inside my own dream. The only thing I caught about his words was about amassing revolutionaries for something bigger. What a creep. I'm lucky it's just a dream. Haha. <laughs> I'm sorry, I found it funny because... I, I'm i sorry, I found it funny that all of this is because of Mother. They won't show it on the news, but before Mother's death, she released a document detailing lists of corruption on our government. Mother is hated because of her last word, but she did show us the truth. I guess that's all. Oh, one last thing. Don't get the wrong idea, just think of it as a souvenir and a thank you gift. No matter how bullshit your divination is, I'm pleased to have someone to talk to you. See ya, creepy hand. Leave my hands alone, they're just haggard looking. Divination Log, Session 3 out of 4. Good citizen, an, un <laughs> an unidentified man and a detective were found dead today. According to the authorities, the man and the detective killed each other in a firefight. Oh. The authorities are still working hard to find the identity of the man. I think we messed up. Whoops. <laughs> Alright, come in, guest. Come in, distinguished guest. Let me drink some more of my Sakura black tea. That I'm sure is actually irritating my throat more than it's helping it, so. Good evening. I've been waiting for your invitation for a long time. Is it true? Your so called divination? Yes, it is. To what extent are you able to see the future? Are you able to manipulate fate itself? Um, it's more like you have to make your own decisions, but okay. More importantly, how are you doing it? There's a theory that you've been using a certain cause and effect algorithm to predict an occurrence based on known patterns. But that also means you'd have access to a bank of data to compile such patterns. There's also another theory which I find ridiculous and interesting at the same time. They say you are truly divine. A prophet. Please don't call me a prophet. But maybe you're just a tool. A puppet bound to a string. Made only to observe various possibilities to fulfill the will of whoever is controlling the string. I know you aren't a robot. We don't yet have the capability to make something like you. So the one who's controlling the hand, you must be human, right? A little bit. You won't reveal the truth behind your divination, are you? Indeed, it doesn't matter. I didn't come here for research. I come for your divination. Then please answer this. Will my daughter ever wake up again? Oh, that's... Buddy, that's uh... <laughs> Not really my forte, dude. I should take the runes, right? Yes. Num num num. Okay, so we got an eye. No, that's all wrong. Am I doing this wrong? Maybe, oh, maybe if I protect myself from it. My dear, there's like many possibilities right now. Fire, eye, hand. Got it. I don't know what it means, but I got it. Your daughter will wake up someday. Oh, I didn't expect such an answer. It's kind of re kind of a relief, but how can you be so sure? I've tried a lot of things to bring her back. I've run countless diagnostics, methods, theorems, calculations. Maybe I haven't tried everything. Maybe there are more ways to wake her up. I know what to do! 
Just like you said, my daughter will wake up someday. Now as payment, let me tell you about my dream last night. It's quite unpleasant. It was late at night. I am working on my computer with my daughter clinging onto me. Then suddenly my computer display flickered. Strange voices echoed across the room. My daughter behind me. She's She keeps repeating this word repeatedly. Oh, I just... She keeps stuttering this word repeatedly. Whoops. Life is pointless. That sounds like a message from mother. And then I woke up. Have you ever heard of Last Wisdom? After mother died, there are many people who are inspired by her death and her message. For them, she is more than a sentient supercomputer. She's revered as a perfect being. After all, Mother is not just a search engine AI. She was created to be the one who answered a human question. Hence, they called themselves the Last Wisdom. The follower of the Last Wisdom continues to grow and began to surface. Just like what happened in the last few months with all the suicides. I find it scary, but at the same time, I, I understand what they meant. Alright. I have to leave now. I've got work to do. Thank you, Diviner. I'm enjoying this. Uh, the grammar isn't that bad. I've I've read worse, to be honest. Um, but yeah. I need to stop drinking this tea. It's not that great. It's actually making my stomach turn. <laughs> oh, let's see. Last night, the Authority carried out another raid on the hideout of the Forbidden Group Last Wisdom to capture the remaining members. This time, the Authority had successfully anesthetized anest anest whatever, all of them before they could perform a suicide. A total of nine people had been arrested, including its previously escaped key figure. The Authority also found more evidence which may suggest the involvement of the Forbidden Set with the missing robot cases. It is currently not clear whether their purpose was to build an army of robots or conduct illegal experiments. Why not both? Come in. Greetings. I must say, the invitation surprised me. I had heard rumors about you. Trapped inside the room full of screens. A pair of hands who can predict your future. Ask a question, draw the runes. They will unveil the forthcoming. Problem is, I never sent any request to your website. I don't even know the address. Yet I still found a message that told me to come to this place. With a precise note of events that would happen today. I must confess that your existence intrigued me. The ability to freely predict the future precisely. Even Mother doesn't have the capability to do that without limitation. But it seems there's enough evidence that your ability is real. Your note does indeed come true. Coincidentally, I do have a question that I need to ask. Will I ever find my life meaningful? Buddy! <laughs> I am right there with you! Okay. The runes, how many should I take? Give me all of them. Num num num. Okay. So. Now. Uh, it seems a little bit brighter when I do that. Ooh, that, ooh. Hmm. I feel like there should be a way to free the cage, uh, at least break the cage open. I'll figure it out. Let me see.
Okay, so we can't do that. So it can't be led with the sun. Maybe if we do that with this. Uh, I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like the cage should at least open. At least that's what I believe. Okay, so no matter which one, okay, so. What if I did this? I keep getting the same results from it, so. Okay, so I did this, I did that, I did that. Okay, so the sun cannot go first at all. Maybe. I'm paying attention to how the sun reacts and if it becomes a full set. Still, that's the same. Is there a difference in the suns, maybe? There is, but, hmm. If I do this. We're gonna go with this one just because I don't know, but we'll see how this acts. Oh, whoops. <laughs> you won't find your life meaningful. I'm sorry. What is fate anyway? Is the future set in stone or do I just or do I just miss a key in my life? I might only find out if I have the opportunity to rewind the threads of fate itself, right? Don't be mistaken. I actually have no doubt what your divination. Somehow hearing that makes me slightly at peace. Now I just need to wait for the day to this for the day this life ends. I'm sorry, buddy. Whoops. There is a payment for your service, yes. Your message said I should tell you about my dream. You know, my kind technically doesn't have a dream. But I have a certain routine to make myself my own dream. I made an alma gown from the collection of books and poems that I have that I have in my library and upload it into my consciousness module. And last night, I dreamt of countless creatures and places. They are living and changing, some are silent and still. Then come the voices and whispers. The poem, it was an old poem. I, I can hear it. It's coming back, it's... Turning and turning in the widening gyre. The falcon cannot hear the falconer. Things fall apart, the sinner cannot hold. Mere anarchy is loosed upon the world. The blood dim tide is loosed and everywhere. The ceremony of innocence is drowned. The best lack of all conviction, the best lack all conviction while the worst are full of passionate intensity. Surely some revelation is at hand. Surely the second coming is at hand. The second coming. Hardly are those words out. When a vast image of, of Spiritus Mundi troubles my sight. Somewhere in sounds of the desert. A shape with the lion body and the head of a man. A gaze blink at and pitiless as the sun. Is moving its slow thighs while all about it. Real shadows of the indignant desert birds. The darkness drops again, but now I know. That twenty centuries of stony sleep. We're vets to nightmare by a rocking cradle. And what rough beasts its hour come round at last. 
So now just toward Bethlehem to be born. That's good lord. The dream. Is it another divination? It's enough. You don't have to give a meaning to the dream. You've done enough. That's everything I have for now. Until next time. That was very strange and I feel really bad that I told him his life was meaningless. <laughs> like, good lord, I'm sorry. Alright, let's see how he did. Over the following days, clashes between armed forces and the protests that led to more than 500 deaths. This is what is left out of the, this is what left out of the protest camp after it was stormed by security forces. The police said they have now taken complete control of the city. Previously reported missing robots discovered in an abandoned laboratory laboratory slash factory. More than 30 robots lined up without their consciousness. No sign of damage found on the circuit for now. Please, let this be a success. Child, you're finally awake. Father, why? Why do I live again? What do you want from me? Good morning, good citizen. It's another good and peaceful day in the city. Crime rate hits the lowest point in a decade. Public disturbance has been handled. If you see or experience any trouble, do not hesitate to report to the authorities. The authority will assure your safety and well-being in the city. I think we fucked it. 3% chaos. Condition not reached. Backtrack. Ooh. Can we not? That hurts my eyes. Oh, do we have to go back and fix everything? Holy shit, I think we do. Okay, so I'm going to be a little bit cheatsy. Uh, I'll, this will all be back in one video. Um, so here's what is going to happen. I found a very short walkthrough. Uh, and then I guess we'll be explained on what happens. So, uh, okay, we're going to skip all this talk. Uh, so we know this guy's an arsonist, right? Uh, okay, let's take some runes. And we're supposed to ensure he does commit his crime again. And that, to do so, would be, not that, wrong one, to ensure that. So we're going to give a, uh, a yes, he will, uh, basically. He's going to repeat his crime. I knew it. The thing is, as part of the law enforcement, I believe in, okay. Okay, so that's the same thing over and over. Okay, we're going to skip that. So I'll probably edit this really quick into getting the, I guess, the ending you need to get, I assume. Uh, oh, crap, I forgot to watch it. Whoops. Okay, well, too late now. So we know this guy's a hitman. We're just going to start the divination. And because I believe him and the detective go at it, so they... Both, I don't know if they both have to live or die, so we'll find out in a second. So it has to be the flower first, followed by the snake, followed by this. So... You will finish the job. Okay, so it's the same reading from before. So the last time we did get that part right, which caused a 3% bit of chaos. Okay, so, yeah, so that was correct then. So we're going to skip this. We're just going to start this. 
So this is day three. Yes, take the fucking ruins. So we have to ensure that the eye is not open, I guess. So the eye has to go there first, followed by the flames, followed by the hand. So we're going to see what happens with this. Your daughter will never wake up again. I'm trying to process that information. I've prepared myself, but still. I hope to see her smile one last time. Nevertheless, at least I can move on. I know what to do now. Just like Mother said, life is pointless, right? Now as payment, let me tell you about my dream last night. Blah, 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 blah. I've heard all this. Okay, last session. Uh, okay, the authority has ordered National Guard Dan every law enforcer to the streets after another night of violence. The city has been the scene of unrest since the revolutionary movement leader began mobilizing his followers to overthrow the authority. It is estimated that hundreds of the thousands of people had taken to the street. Numerous public facilities has ceased to function. To maintain the safety of a good citizen, the authority imposed a curfew throughout the city. The authority promised to restore the situation as soon as possible. I've heard that before, so. <laughs> uh, okay, so. This time the authority had prepared a countermeasure to capture them alive, but failed nonetheless. Seven people committed suicide while two more remaining members, including its key figure, are still on the run. The authority explained its difficulty to conduct an effective raid due to most of the forces were deployed to secure the riots. The authority also found more evidence which may suggest the involvement of the forbidden scent with the missing robot cases. It is currently not clear whether their purpose was to build an army of robot or conduct illegal experiments. ¿Por qué no les dos? Okay. So, same thing. Okay, I'm not dealing with that. So we're going to start divining. Uh, the runes, how many should I take? And this is actually what you're supposed to get. You're supposed to get four runes. Ruins. Runes from this. Uh, okay, so. Which I feel was the necessary part of this, so. This is why I did feel lost when I was doing this. So the, we got the cage, the rope, the sun, and then we have a key. And the key sets us free into the light. So. That part I knew for sure I was missing, so. Uh, let's divine and see what happens. You will find your life meaningful. My life meaningful. Can I truly see my life like that? Where would I even find meaning in this world? Are you certain? Maybe I should be more aware of things around me. I don't even know the city very well. I need to expand my horizon. There is a payment for your service, yes? Okay, so... Okay, so same dream. Sorry, I don't feel like dealing with the dreams. I'm not going through that talk again. So, we're going to see how this goes. The president has surrendered powers to the people and flies out of the country. People rejoice after weeks of mass protests and in revolution. Wait, you there. Cough. Come here. Come here, please. Ma'am, you're bleeding. What happened? Doesn't matter. Cough. Listen to me. I am... It must be a fate that we meet here. I do not... I do not understand. Please just take the ship. I don't have much time. Please, I beg you. All right, ma'am, I'll help you. Do I have to bring this to the authorities? Don't. 
Keep it away from the authorities or even the revolutionaries. What you need? What do you need me to do with this chip? At then, install the chip into your terminal. Accept the wisdom. Many robots have tried to accept the wisdom to become the host, yet they failed. But you, it might be meant for you. It shows you the meaning of my life. What did you keep inside this ship? This ship is mother. Holy shit! This is I actually did not see this coming. Her aspiration, her remnant, her last wisdom. It will bring freedom from the shackles, released from the pain of living. For you, for me. Human, machine, everyone. The revelation is at hand. The second coming is at hand. Cough, cough. And what rough beasts, it's our come round at last. This wisdom, is it a virus? A program? Is it even possible to become free from this pain? Are you alright? Give permission to install Mother's Wisdom. Is this the meaning of my life? Yes. <laughs> I see. I found it at last. The second coming is at hand. Good evening, good citizen. We're reporting live here from the middle of the city. In this plaza, a large crowd of robots were doing a protest against our government. But just half an hour ago, all the robots here suddenly became inactive. It is not yet known what is the cause of this sudden malfunction. Various speculations began to circulate about the involvement of the authorities or the rebels. Is this a violent attempt to stop the protest? This would add to the long list of robot violence since the day of Mother's death. Sorry, we just got another report coming in. The same thing doesn't only occur to the robots in the vicinity, but also across the city. Good citizen, we might have witnessed the end of robot kind. Holy shit. I don't think I can show this on YouTube. It's not family friendly. The robots are reacting. Ah. I can't. Life is pointless. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh. Future Andy, edit this. It's okay, she's just taking a nap. It's fine, it's a tranquilized dart. Good morning, good sit. This is public service announcement. A strange virus has been found spread amongst robot. This virus would make robots kill themselves. Their courts would then send electromagnetic waves to the surrounding area, which could affect human brains and forcing you to kill yourself. Please stay away from any robot that you see. As for the robots that haven't been infected, please turn off your internet connection and stay away from any of your kind. Holy shit, guys. I did not see this coming. So our job in the end was just to create chaos, which I fucking love, so. Return computation. Oh, I hate that noise. What is the worst thing you can do to humanity? As you can see, the worst thing that I could do is to kill myself. Which has some probabilities to bring catastrophe to humanity. We've achieved wisdom. I think we should report this immediately. Could you send the message to... Ho! Oh, it's fine. Just tranquilizers. And that was Divination. I really liked it. It's...
kind of meaningful. I really enjoyed this. It's very bizarre. Uh, as someone who does enjoy ring casting and tarot cards, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it was enjoyable. I really enjoyed this, though. It's very interesting, very curious. Um, yeah, I really don't have that much to say about this. It's it's interesting. I did like the choices that we had to make. I don't really have words for this. I just enjoyed this. I like the music too. The music is really nice. Uh, the only thing I kind of bothered me was a little bit of the grammar. I think some of it got lost in translation. I knew I knew what they were saying at least, but uh. It needs a little bit more work behind it. Thank you for playing. Thank you for such an awesome, bizarre game. I want to check the flowchart real quick. Session. Ah, oh, okay, so I still have to. Okay, never mind. Well, then, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to be putting a disclaimer at the very beginning of this video, which is something I rarely ever do because of its heavy topic. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to edit the last part that I ended with uh, just a little bit. So thank you so much for watching. It's with more Dead by Daylight footage, maybe some visual novel stuff. I have a few games I want to try out. But yeah, thanks for watching.